Denard Robinson leads the nation in rushing, leads the nation in total offense at 410 yards per game. Through only three games, Robinson has put himself in the middle of the early Heisman conversation. The impact Bobby players has got to be Denard Robinson. As you mentioned, leading the country in rushing and in all-purpose yards, he is doing everything for Michigan. Robinson to throw. He's already one for one, and that's good for a first down. Roy Roundtree gets out across the 30-yard line. And off to Smith. He almost scooted through as we take a look at the rest of our impact players. Tracking Denard Robinson all over the field. Robinson goes deep down the sideline. Has a man. It's Roundtree again. First down inside the Bowling Green 30-yard line. Take a look at that last throw by Denard. Stoneham runs a corner route. He's open by, or Roundtree runs the corner route. He's open by four yards. And you see a little rollout to allow Denard Robinson to see down the field. He's only six feet there on the ball. And off to Shaw. He breaks a tackle. Hard running by Shaw inside the 20. Out of bounds at the 16-yard line of first down. Straight run by Robinson. Inside the 10, close to another Michigan first down. Now Michigan inside the red zone has been as good as you can be through three games. Robinson, up the middle for the touchdown. Walks in for his fifth rushing touchdown of the year. Take a look at the patience of Denard Robinson. Wants to go up the middle. It's two guys inside, and he just bounces it out, and it's a walk-in touchdown. Very difficult to game when he did it against Notre Dame. The last to do it was Pat White under Rich Rodriguez. And now he's three for three. That time to Kelvin Grady. As we take a look at Michigan's starting offensive lineup. They started uh, 39 and 19 games, respectively. Robinson up the middle, and he gets to the sideline. Bounds at the 45-yard line, and the true freshman Stephen Hopkins in a tailback that time was the lead blocker. Becomes the blocker. Junior Hemingway on the screen picks up about seven yards. Two tight ends on a long third and one. Robinson, nice cutback. Denard Robinson into the open field. There he goes. Let's go back and look at the touchdown. It's a designed quarterback sweep. You're going to see Denard Robinson take this ball to the outside, try to get a block on the edge. But right here, Bowling Green in good shape. Three defenders there. And Keith Morgan, number 32 in white, just misses the tackle and overruns it. Another missed tackle. And once he gets in the open field, I'm sorry, but uh, nobody is going to catch Denard Robinson. He's got the nose for the end zone. And if we saw the last drive, he can take it the distance. And he'll try it again here. There he goes again. Denard Robinson down the sideline. All the way into Bowling Green territory before they finally bump him out. And he's shaking up. Gardner will throw it down the sideline for Roundtree. Check that for Stoneham. He's got it inside the 15-yard line with a flag down. Ron, he's physical, very good uh, prospect. Gallon makes a move at the 10. Horse collared into the end zone. So Jeremy Gallon got inside the pylon. It's another Michigan touchdown, and they've got a three-score lead. Goal and now to the bottom of your screen comes down Van here. Again, it's Jordan Hopgood. Nobody's covered him again. 13th play of the drive, fourth and goal from the one. Hopgood tries the middle again, moves the pile right at the goal line. No signal yet. Bowling Green thinks he got in. 
signal and it is a touchdown. Gardner looks for the bomb down the sideline. Incomplete, dropped by Junior Hemingway. The scene caught into the open field goes Kelvin Grady. Touchdown. There's a flag down back at about the 37 yard line of Bowling Green. Personal foul, number 50 of the offense hitting a defensive player at the 15 yard line. Bowling Green's defense to get off the field. Gardner on a slant first down. This time Junior Hemingway made sure he held on to the football and it's a first down for Michigan inside the 35 yard line of Bowling Green. Well, they just read uh, a penalty call one back and a drop pass. And they'll go for it on fourth and five rather than try the long field goal. Underneath, broken up. So Bowling Green's defense gets the stop and rather than try a 46 yard field goal, a good indication. field as well. The blitz comes off the edge, unloading in time as Pankratz. And into the open field goes Tyrone Pronti. Down the sideline, Pronti. They won't catch him. Touchdown. Obviously, Rich Rodriguez uh, feels differently, wants to get Tate Forcier back into this football game in case he needs him. Forcier on third down and eight to the sideline. Long completion and a first down. He found Martavius Odom. Right up the middle goes Shaw. He's a tough runner, isn't he? First down to the Bowling Green 40-yard line. Four-man rush, Forcier well protected, pumps once and buys himself some time. Lobs it downfield for Roundtree. Bumped, flag out. Roundtree got a step on Javan Leacock. Roundtree again, makes a move. And another, breaks a tackle at the 20. Hit from behind all the way down to the 10-yard line. It'll be first and goal for the Maize and Blue. Six for six on this drive. Right up the middle goes Shaw. Cut down at the five, and he falls to about the two. It'll be second down and goal. Shaw powers his way into the end zone for another Michigan touchdown. In the first half, but third downs and long yardage, they need to put pressure. High snap over the punter's head out of the back of the end zone for a safety. Neil Dahlman, the long snapper, launched it over Brian Wright's head. And finally, he's able to send it deep. Stone him at the 21-yard line. Tries to turn the corner. Cuts it back at the 40. Tripped up at midfield. He became a starter. Forcier off play action. Lofts one, and he's got round trip. Inside the 30. He's back out there and contributing to this team. Shaw goes up the middle. Down to the 20 yard line. That's a gain of eight more yards on first down for Michigan. And they. Again, it's Shaw, finds a crease. Inside the 10, nine more yards for Michael Shaw. Forciana play action fake, flips it wide open at the goal line. Is John McColgan the fullback? And he falls into the end zone for an easy Michigan touchdown. Play action for Pankratz. The seam intercepted, picked off by Jonas Muta. Forcier rolls out. Up the sideline is Gallon. Jeremy Gallon bumped out inside the 10 yard line. First and goal, Michigan at the eight. Uh, running backs. 
and Smith inside the five breaks a tackle and Michigan has another touchdown. Fourth and goal again. And Kratz moves out of the backfield. Direct snap to Jordan Hopgood up the middle bouncing off the pile. Touchdown. Michigan had him stood up but they couldn't wrap him up. Just rubbing it in at the end there. Forcier to the sideline. As Brian Greasy sees Daryl Stoneham make another catch at a 23 point lead. Forcier finds Roy Roundtree. Another first down for Michigan. Tate Forcier is now 12 for 12. He comes up limping up. ESPN and Michigan with 538 yards of total offense through the first three quarters. Second and four at the Bowling Green 25. Forcier cuts it inside. First and goal, Wolverines. Vincent and Smith at the five, lowers his shoulder. And he's down to about the three. If you're just joining us, And Smith, another easy Michigan touchdown. Down a little bit, but top to bottom, the Big Ten is very competitive and strong this season. Forcier right up the middle on third down. He's got a first down. Back to Wendy Nix. Cox with a first down. It's a series that championship in the Big Ten. You have got to play defense. They have got to get better in that area. It's Gerald Toussaint into the open field. There goes the red shirt freshman. Caught from behind down to the five yard line. Great job on the pull by the right guard, Momay, right there, 65, who knocks him out and then right up the gut consistently all day. Michigan has had an opportunity for big gainers up the middle with huge holes on the inside. And now it's Toussaint, the uh, true freshman's opportunity to get in there and get some yardage. He takes the handoff, cuts it back at the five and into the end zone. Two carries for Fitzgerald Toussaint. And a touchdown to contend for a Big Ten championship, and if they could find any consistency on defense, they may do that. Into the open field goes Michael Cox. Inside the 30-yard line of Bowling Green. Gardner pulls it down, and he's out of bounds at about the 15-yard line with another first down for Michigan. Michigan will go for it on fourth down and three. Gardner rolls. Looks for the pylon. He's in. Touchdown, Michigan. Well, we received word from the Michigan sideline that Denard Robinson was cleared to play if necessary in the second half. Gardner and Forcier have made that point move. They've both been good. For NASCAR. <laughs> First down for Bowling Green. Half minute to go. Hagel looks for the big one over the middle. Intercepted. Picked off by Ray Vinipal. Vinipal hit, fumbles the football. Jordan Hopgood picks it up. It goes back to Bowling Green with 20 seconds to go. Our final score once again Michigan 65, Bowling Green 21. This has been a presentation of ESPN, the worldwide leader in sports. For Brian Greasy and our entire ESPN crew, I'm Bob Wischusen. So long from Ann Arbor.